While drilling a nine and a half hole section at 7,600 feet, the drilling team encounters a previously identified weak and unconsolidated sand formation. After drilling 30 feet below a known loss zone, the mud logger reports partial loss of returns. The driller notices a gradual increase in torque and drag, along with a slight reduction in rate of penetration (ROP). The standpipe pressure shows minor fluctuations, but circulation is still possible. The cuttings at the shale shakers appear loose, fine, and sandy, with evidence of unconsolidated material entering the mud system. After several more feet of drilling, torque and drag rise sharply, and pump pressure increases, suggesting a restriction in the annulus. The driller stops rotation and attempts to circulate, but flow rate is restricted. Upon pulling out of hole a few stands, the string frees up, and a large volume of sand and silt returns to surface. Question, what is the most likely cause of the increased torque, drag, and loss of returns in this scenario? A differential sticking. B. Bit balling. C. Sand bridge or fill from formation. D. Key seating. Check the comments below for the correct answer and a full explanation.